It's that time of the week again, Faust Friday with Tim Vigil, and we are on Act 3, and, uh, what is there to say about Faust? Gory, outlaw comic, and, uh, one of my favorite comic books to look at. I'll be honest with you, I haven't read much of it, because, uh, I just like looking at it more so than reading it. So, we are looking at 1990. No offense to David Quinn, by the way. I'm sure you are a great writer. I'm just into the art. So, our last issue was 89, I'm guessing. So, uh, here we go. We are back in the thick of it. And Tim Vigil is doing his Tim Vigil thing. Drawing great faces. Drawing great anatomy. Even the stuff like people talking with one another. He makes it look interesting. That's a great panel right there. I just love the amount of detail. I mean, that's the thing. Like, I keep saying the same thing over and over again about, his, like, his art. But it's so detailed. I love the close-up of the eyes. I love the choice of the panels. I love that no panel is similar to another panel. It's all different. You're getting different stuff. I mean, this guy really, really understands how to draw comics. I love that Danzig uh, hair there. Is that Danzig? No, it's the other dude. What's the other dude's name? The other dude from the Misfits. Probably a fan of the Misfits. How could you not be? And I love that panel right there, that close-up. Very cool. This comic looks fucking great. Look how sadistic this bitch looks. <laughs> but man, what a great drawing. Just like every page you turn, you're just like, oh, that's a better drawing. And, you, and, and the crazy thing about it is you can see Tim Vigil's growth from issue one to two to three. And you keep seeing it. Oh, look at those hands, man. man. Jumping through the window. Glass shards all over the place. I'm a I'm a sucker for that. I just love the fucking... I just love everything this guy does. <laughs> everything looks so good. Like, even the cars. The cars are boxy, but they look cool. The other thing I noticed about Faust is, like, you'll read an issue of Faust, and it'll be, like, the gore issue. And then the next issue will be the sex issue. I love that Joe Vigil has some backup stuff here, too. But, uh... Man... I love it. I absolutely love everything he's drawing. So let's take a look at Joe Vigil. Still doing great art. He's growing too as an artist, really. Very different than uh, what I feel like Joe Vigil usually does. Man, I love those arms. I just love great anatomy. That's great. That's super cool. You know, let's go back through this one more time. Let's kind of try to find some interesting panels. Still probably my favorite panel in the book. I love that. I love that drawing. Like, if I did a drawing like that, I'd, I'd be like, holy shit. <laughs> I really am a good artist. I really am a great artist. But, yeah, I just love the, how he shows that outline of the scapula going into the uh, deltoid. Very cool. Just like, oh, man, that surface anatomy. And I love that panel, too. I mean, every panel just looks great. Every panel just looks so good. What a great look. What a great looking comic. And it only gets better, and it only makes you feel worse about your art as you go on, but whatever. You know, I just look at this stuff because I'm like, man, I, I want some inspiration, you know? I want to, uh, maybe one day I can draw like, like Tim Vigil. Maybe one day. Maybe one day I'll be able to draw like Joe, draw like Joe Vigil too, you know. 
because they're both fucking great. Yeah, I love that panel too. And that's the thing is, like, I notice, like, anytime I look through this, I notice something new every time, because there's so much going on in the page. I'm just like kind of like, I'm just like breathing it in for a second. Kind of like understanding even like how somebody could be this great of an artist. And I know there's some people that don't like his art. But I don't understand how you can not like his art. It doesn't make any sense to me. Just the expression, the, the anatomy, the gesture. That how every panel is completed. You don't ever get like a samey panel from him. Unless of course it's supposed to be like through a time. Like you know like somebody having sex. <laughs> then sure the panels will be slightly samey. But even then it's like yeah. He changes up the perspective. And yeah. Anyways that is Faust issue 2. Or F Faust issue 3. I'm sorry. Faust, Faust issue 3. Here on Fast Friday, and uh, it does not disappoint. Next week, we are going to do Act 4. And then the week after that, we are going to do, yes, you guessed it, Act 5. So I'm super excited to continue looking through the series. I think I have the first 11 issues. It may be 10. I'm not sure, but I think it's 11. Um, and, uh, yeah, thanks for watching, guys. Appreciate it.